If you're a woman who has no insurance or can't afford a mammogram, grab a pen, have a seat. There is an effort underway right now that can get you the potentially life-saving appointment. And your side, Stephanie Harris is here now with How It Works. All right, so you guys have heard me talk about the Bra Ha Ha before. It's a really fun fundraiser for the Breast Center at Chesapeake Regional. Well, right now is when that money raised starts to save lives. So there's a phone a thon going on right now so uninsured and underinsured women can get a mammogram. And if past years are any indication, they will save a life. Mm -hmm. Jeanette Demko is a survivor. And you can live with it and you can have hope. She noticed a problem in 2015. It just didn't feel right, you know, and when you... If not for insurance, well, she can't even imagine. That's why she's spreading the word. You don't have to take it out of your pocket. If you don't have it, someone's going to help you find it. Money raised through the Braha Ha pays for mammograms at the Breast Center at Chesapeake Regional Healthcare. Last year, 85 women came in, seven required biopsies, and one was diagnosed with cancer. The whole purpose of screening mammography is to catch women who don't have risk factors. So 75% of women diagnosed with breast cancer have no risk factors. So if we only focus on women with risk factors, we're going to miss the vast majority of people who will develop breast cancer. That's why Dr. Natalie Simmons says they're constantly investing in new and improved forms of detection. So you can see this is our table. The Sophia, as it's called, looks and feels like a spa table. There's a special location that tells them where to place their breast. It's an automated ultrasound. There's no squeezing or radiation. And it can be viewed in multiple planes. It takes these full breast images in seconds, which can detect things mammograms may miss in women with dense breast tissue. That's about half of all women. With the increasing evidence, some states are actually mandating insurance companies cover it like a screening mammogram. Right now in Virginia, we don't have that yet. But don't worry, she says, mammograms are still the gold standard for all women over 40. Your body is the most important thing you have, so take care of it.